Hi guys, this is Noiser with another episode of Quick Tips, the series where I post short videos each containing one tip of how to improve your game in Rainbow Six Siege. This time I want to share a very easy and really fun tip that seems to be helping me a lot in multiplayer. Yes, this is Terrorist Hunt you're watching, but bear with me, I have uh, I found a certain way of, of practicing that gave direct results and that's what this video is all about. Uh, I think I've told you before that I'm sort of average when it comes to individual skill. I play with quite low sensitivity to make it a bit easier, but that also makes clutch situations a bit harder. Uh, and I become a sitting duck when I feel uncomfortable. And for that reason, I wanted to practice to be more aggressive and confident. An idea I actually got from a viewer, so thanks a lot for that, Moonrunners. Now, going far outside of, outside of uh, my comfort zone isn't something I like doing when other players depend on me, so that's why I chose Terrorist Hunt, with the sole effort to put myself in harm's way as much and as often as possible. But, and this is important, without being sloppy with the details, mining reloads, using cover, peeking, etc. I played like 10 consecutive games and what I noticed was that I improved the speed of my decision making and the speed in my fingers and therefore my confidence, because in Terrorist Hunt you get to do loads of encounters in a short period of time. My recommendation is to do this in normal, unless you find hard a walk in the park of course, because uh, this is supposed to be fun and easy enough so you can get like 10-20 kills in a round, depending on how aggressive your teammates are of course. Uh, you can do this solo as well, but I don't find that nearly as fun, and this sort of practice should be fun, I think, uh, as I play this game for fun and not competitive. Uh, another recommendation is to raise the sensitivity one step before trying this, if you think you might gain from that. That's what I did, and I will never go back. So, to sum this up, jump into a game of terrorist hunt, be aggressive, and go where the action is, but try to perform all the little reminders that already improves your multiplayer game. Minding reloads, peeking corners, uh, burst firing or, or whatever they might be. When I went to, uh, into a casual game after this, I, I played differently, I played faster and more confident and, and therefore better, so um, I hope this would this will work out the same for you as well and now don't be set back if it doesn't work right away because I mean that of course depends on your opponents uh, this is something I will do again anyway on on a regular basis because it's the it's the most fun and rewarding practice I've I've had yet so that's about it guys how do you practice to improve have you got any tips that work for you please tell me by leaving a comment below and I would love if you gave me a thumbs up if you find this helpful in any way. And if you're not already a subscriber, you are so welcome to be that, uh, to stay up to date with my future content. On Thursday I will be uploading the next episode of Equipped, my operator guide, and uh, until then, I will keep being noiser. Hey, do.